Hi there, this is Dr. Muzaffar Saruhi and today we shall discuss the general description of family malatesi. I shall share a separate document uh, with the complete description and figures of various taxonomic terms generally used to describe taxa. Malatesi is a large family consisting of 144 genera and more than 5000 species worldwide. Only 26 species of 7 genera of this family are recorded in Pakistan. The members of this family are found across the world, but the family is abundant in tropics, subtropics, and uh, very dominant in Australia. The family is represented by seven genera in Pakistan, which are genus Cizygium, which produce a very delicious fruit called Javan, as shown in pictures, and uh, genus Myrtus, genus Cedium, and uh, genus Melaleuca. Genus Calistemon, a common ornamental tree named as bottle brush, and uh, genus uh, Eucalyptus, which is widely planted on brackish soil and roadside, and genus Corymbia, which is closely related to the Eucalyptus in their appearance. The family is generally characterized by shrubs and trees with flaky bark. If you remove the bark from the trunk, it should break into pieces with little pressure. The members of this family possess gland dotted leaves. They possess oil glands in their leaves which generally produce tarpanes. The leaves of plant may entire with inframarginal venation. The flowers possess numerous stamens. It has inferior ovary often united with hypanthium. The members of this family possess simple leaves with undivided lamina and entire margin. Occasionally leaves with serenate or ciliate margins. The arrangement of leaves on a stem is alternate or opposite fashion. In alternate arrangement, only single leaf arise from the node. In contrast, two leaves arise opposite to each other at each node in opposite phyllotexy. Inflorescence is the term used for describing the arrangement of flowers on a stem. The members of the family have varied inflorescences. It includes panicle, corium, and dichesal cyme. Panicle is a branch racemose inflorescence with the flowers being born on the branches of the main axis. Corium is a flat topped racemose inflorescence with longer lower pedicels and shorter upper pedicels so that all flowers reach the same level. Dichesal cyme in contrast is a kind of cymose inflorescence in which two branches arise below the apical flower at each level so that the flower is, it, is between the fork of two branches and it further continues in that fashion. Mostly the flowers are actinomorphic in their cemetery, which means flowers can be divided into equal halves when cut along any vertical plane. However, zygomorphic flowers are also present in members of the family. The flowers are bisexual having both androsium and gynosium in the same flower. The flowers are epigynous or perigynous. It defines the position of the ovary with relation to the other floral parts on the thalamus. In epigynous flowers, the ovary is inferior to the other three parts. Here the thalamus encloses the ovary inside it and the other three holes which are sepal, petals and stamens, are located about it. Whereas in perigynous flowers the ovary is in the center and all four holes are almost at the same level. Flowers usually have bracts. The flowers bear a hollow receptacle which is fused to gynosium to form Hypanthium. The flowers bear four to five petals with a varied arrangement fashion. Most of the time petals are free but also found fused to form a claptra. Also flowers has four to five sepals which may be free and arranged in embricate fashion. The flowers bear four to five petals with a varied arrangement fashion. Most of the time petals are free but also found fused to form a claptra. Also, flowers has four to five sepals, which may be free and arranged in embricate fashion. The flowers possess numerous stamens, which may be free. In some cases, you may find stamens connate at the base into bundles. The stamens possess short anthers, which may be basifixed or versatile in attachment to the filament. The anthers have two chambers, which produce pollen grains. Occasionally, the flowers produce estrile stamens, which is called staminodes. 
Mostly the flowers have inferior ovary, as discussed earlier, possessing two or more ovules in each locule. The members of this family produce various kinds of fruits. The majority of them produce capsule, berry, or droop. Capsule is the most common fruit type. It is dry fruit which is splits open to release the seeds. It is common in eucalyptus and calistemon species. A droop is a single fleshy fruit with a hard stone which contains a single seed. Whereas a berry is a single fleshy fruit without a stone, usually containing number of seeds. I hope you have an idea about the family now. For further in understanding about the terminology, I have shared a PDF document containing relevant terminology. I also suggest you to refer to plant taxonomy book written by O.P. Sharma. And your assignment is to write the economic importance of the family Myrtaceae with a focus on the species growing in our region. You can find the species name in Flora of Pakistan that is available online too. For further discussion and questions, please join our WhatsApp group if you are not already there. And thank you very much.